If you don't sell yourself, you are just playing a microwave. Guys, when's the first time that happened to you? That's right, 1K. Speaking of that, we didn't that other one. I know it's all about watch time these days, but my channel recently started. This 2013 video only took 2015 days to hit that mark. That's like one view for every 20 days. We all have problems, man. You know, I can't swim. I can't catch a Lugia. I, I can't catch the Dark Magician. I can drink soda now, though. Pretty happy that happened. <laughs> I'm gonna fall over! This is actually really impressive. For a channel that's been uploading content since at least 2010, only now, 2019, are we hitting the 1K barrier. Like, what's our secret? That should be a world wonder. Let's get that in Civ 6. Civ 6! What is the secret juice to not being successful? Oh, that's, that's easy. Um, we don't promote, uh, have terrible hashtags, no calls to action, no community outreach, and, and we don't know the first or last name or even the last four digits of our target audience. Most of our content is also irrelevant, has low to no watch time, and no place to hang its hat. We might have fixed that last one by accident. I didn't mean to better my chances. That's how you fly under the radar. That's how you become like a stealth channel. That's what we are, we're a stealth channel, right? But not anymore. Those days are over. They're over now. We hit 1K views. There's no going back. Unless I delete the video. We have to succeed. We have to strive for... No! I'm looking at the engagement on the video and it's honestly like a flashback. Most of the comments are from friends and close supporters. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. This has never happened before on my channel. This is amazing. If you want to be successful on YouTube, just don't do what I did. Be better. Do the things I didn't do. Like, if you have money, don't just spend it on promotion without a strategy. Do your research first. Get to know your target audience. Well, who's your target audience? I'm like, maybe it's the same age group that you're trying to reach. Or maybe you both like games or something. You want to see some really bad hashtags? Bam! Those were my hashtags on SoundCloud. Absolute crud. Yeah, <laughs> it's the first time I bet anyone said crud this year. Look at how other people are using hashtags. I went to one other artist and looked at how they were using hashtags and was like, oh yeah, I'm not doing hashtags right. I'm looking at that and I can just see where I'm going wrong. Put calls of action on your channel and videos like, hey, subscribe here, check out my music here. The first two lines on your YouTube description are easy to see and everything else you need to hit show more usually. And find people. If you're just uploading to a wall, only the wall is going to subscribe and it doesn't have a YouTube account. It's on Vimeo. Well, what's community? Facebook, Twitter, Reddit, 9gag, YouTube itself, SoundCloud, Reverb Nation, DeviantArt. Man, there's places everywhere. Find communities with shared interests. Check out other people's stuff. Then you can collaborate and share each other's fan bases. And if you put in the effort, if you do put in the effort, think smart and one day you might just hit Domestic 10k? No, that's a wild 10k. Mm. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you got something out of that. I really want to start a conversation about this. Dang near everyone struggles on YouTube. What was your first video to hit a thousand views? Write it down in the comments how it went down. Write it down in the comments! And what is your goal for YouTube this year? My goal is to hit 1k subs. <sighs> Let's go big. Let's go big. Fun stuff, guys. Uh.